Hello everyone, Juicebags here, and welcome back to some Terraria 1.3. Did uh, a little bit more on the old home remodel. Still got a long ways to go. Threw in a little uh, viewing space there with some glass. Got the uh, brick wall squared away a little bit more. Now, um, one of the things I've been curious about is uh, I saw that this Mur Mura Mura Muramasa, whatever the hell it's called, it's got the little material tag on it. So after uh, talking to New Seth, who is Jack, Jake, <laughs> I'm constantly forgetting his name now that Seth is gone. It's just terrible. But anyway, when I talk to him and I look, I see the Knight's Edge. Then I look the Knight's Edge up and it, uh, on the wiki, says it's some heavy duty badassery. In fact, they say it's the most powerful pre-hard mode melee weapon available. So, uh, I kind of wanted to go through and get that done. Now, I'm missing one thing. I've got the Blood Butcher. I went down got some more Hellstone and got the, uh, Fiery Greatsword as well. Of course, I've already got the Deadly Muramasa from the chest in the dungeon. And last but not least, I'm going to need... The Blade of Grass. Now, the Blade of Grass is going to be uh, crafted with... Let me see. I can't even remember. Just 12 Jungle Spores, 12 Stingers. Now, unfortunately, I only have 10 Jungle Spores. Do I have any Stingers? Yeah, and I've got 10 Stingers. So I need to pick up some more stingers and some more jungle spores. So off to the jungle we go here. And uh, see if we can get that stuff locked up. And create this badass sword. Now I do like the fact that the Miramasa has got the, the auto swing going. I'm hoping this new one will, but I doubt it will. It uh, certainly makes things convenient for clearing out vines, whatever the case may be. Uh, running around, killing the, uh, you know, the little baddies, the slimes and whatnot. Got a cat howling at the door. Neighbor's cat likes to come and terrorize my cat. Oh, yeah. I don't know if you can hear it in the background, but it's there's some serious meowing going on at the door right now. <laughs> anyway, we're almost there. Yeah, anyway, the auto swing is very, very nice. I'm hoping that this new uh, new weapon has the auto swing as well. But if not, you know, I can live without it. Obviously, uh, you know, I want the best weapons I can. And supposedly, that is one of them. And here we are. Let's go ahead and head on down. And, um, so the... What, the stingers are from bees. I'm gonna have to find... Find where them bees are hiding. I can't, uh, can't quite remember. And... And the jungle spores are gonna be... They're going to be from something else. I don't even remember. But uh, I should be able to kill some baddies here. Get things all wrapped up. Can't remember which uh, which way I had dug out. Looks like uh, this is it. I think there's going to be some bees down here somewhere, potentially. Where is the bees? What do we have down there? A little bit of lag going on there. Let me see. Alright, so I gotta go way down further. It looks like the... Uh... Actually, there's a beehive just over there to the east as well. 
which I should be able to go what up and over to get to I believe or you know what here's bees right here and how will it I'm just gonna kill what I got in front of me and hope that uh, I get all the materials I need Oh yeah. Oh, there we go. Let's see, there's a couple, there's the jungle spores I needed, so I'm good there now. I just need to find those dang bees. Let's see on the map again. Uh, it looks like I bypassed some of them. You can go, um, what it looked like you could go down around here, maybe, and come up with some baddies. Let's hope, uh, oh, well, there's certainly a little beehive action going right there, that's for dang sure. See if we can find some bees running around in here. There we go. There's bee action. Oh dang it, that's not a bee. I thought for sure there was a bee in there. There's some honey. Ooh, that stuff's gooey. this big ass beehive with no bees. How odd. Very peculiar. Let's see. I want to get out of this hive. I don't need any more jungle spores. There's uh, there's some baddies going up here. Where'd you go, you damn bee? Just a slime, huh? Could have swore I saw some bees somewhere. No. Oh, the rough landing. I need to start using my uh, my little item that reduces the or eliminates the fall damage. That would be ideal. Let's see. Come on, you can do it! What the hell is this guy shooting at? Oh, it's a bee! Good lord, there was a bee. Well, there's a stinger. Obviously, I need a few more of those guys. Life crystals. Dang life crystals. And there it was the rest of the stingers I needed. Awesome. So, let's get back out of there and see if it'll let us craft this bad boy now. There it is, the blade of grass. Awesome. So that'll be all four of the swords I need. See now... Where are you? Is it because it... no? should make a molten axe. I've got the mats for it. I can get rid of my uh, 
my axe that I have. Now, what am I missing? I've got... Oh, you know what? I'm going to have to go to a altar, I, I bet. Or uh, one of those forges or whatever the case is. Let's uh, run off to the crimson here and check it out. Sun's starting to come up, looks like. I need to get up there and get rid of those mud blocks too. I don't want uh, I don't want that there. I just want the one sky bridge with nothing else coming off of it. I hope that this new weapon has the auto swing. It's not gonna. I just know it's not gonna. But boy, it would be awesome. This little imp is pretty badass. I mean, it uh, it gets the job done for you. It takes out quite a bit of stuff. It actually took out all those bees. It was all dark. I didn't even realize that uh, that's what it was down there fighting. And, um, you know, lo and behold, pile full of stingers at the bottom. Alright, let's see. This should be somewhere right down here. Somewhere close where I can make that bad boy. Let's see, is this gonna do it? It is Knight's Edge. Ba Bam. Oh crap, that was the wrong. I got all excited for a minute thinking it was auto swinging. Well, it doesn't auto swing, but like I said, according to the wiki, it is the best pre-hard mode melee weapon there is. And, uh, you know, whatever. No auto swing, but a few additional clicks here and there won't kill me. Let's see if I got enough. How much cash do I got? Ooh, I've only got two gold. So I definitely need to do some gold farming and uh, get myself to a position where I can reforge this new and improved mighty melee weapon. But there we go, the Knight's Edge. So uh, pretty stoked to have that. Still got a lot of uh, home improvements to do. A little more interior design and all that good stuff. But it's definitely coming along. Coming along nicely indeed. Uh, got the um, of course, I made the imp staff. As you see, I've got the imp and then the little heart from uh, busting the hearts to kill uh, kill the brain. That little pet came up, and it gives you—it doesn't give you much light. I've actually still been using the miner's helmet, the mining helmet, but uh, it gives off a little bit, so it's definitely beneficial. And like where things are going so far. So thank you for watching. Click that like button. Please subscribe to the channel. And we'll be back soon with some more Terraria 1.3. See you then.